don't know how it is. So today we're going to be destroying my white fidget spinner, which I actually um, bought. It was black. It cost me $12. It was a while ago. It's broken, kind of, now. So we're going to see how much it takes to actually destroy the fidget spinner, guys. Rock TV, you ready? Yes. That's gotta do. So there seems to be no damage because this crack right here was originally here and so was this crack. Let's flip it over. Nothing. Little Same two cracks. A little bit chipped paint. But so today is the day we smash it. Smash film. Here, I think it's about time to smash this right, thing for real. Okay. Okay. Before we ask our parents to run it over with their car, I'm just gonna throw it at the ground. I think she got one of the bearings out, but it's actually not go. ruined. What? Did you break that? Outside bearings? Alright guys, we're gonna get a hammer and try to break it right down the middle. Right here, because you know, there's like a little gap in there or whatever, so. Let's try it. So as you can tell, it is pretty hard to break a fidget spinner, and uh, if you want to break a fidget spinner, you gotta drop a brick on it, you gotta smash it with a hammer, you gotta do something pretty, pretty good. You can't just drop it off a deck and expect it to explode like I did. So if you guys did enjoy this video, please drop a like for me, pretty much wasting $10 and then breaking a fidget spinner, so peace out.